Yo, what's up, guys? How are you? Today, man, coming to us some more NFL break news of the day. I'll be talking about my New England Patriots and somebody actually from the Patriots because according to Ian Rappaport, Jacoby Myers has officially left the New England Patriots to join Josh McDaniels and the Las Vegas Raiders on a deal, on a three-year deal for $33 million, but $21 million guaranteed. The Raiders just love taking our players, and now he is with Jimmy Garoppolo. I don't know if he played with Jimmy Garoppolo when Brady was here, when, when Jimmy G was here as well, but Jimmy G, the former Pat, now Myers, the former Pat, and obviously Josh McDaniels, the former Pat's OC. Well, it's just a Patriots connection with the Las Vegas Raiders and now their new quarterback, Jimmy Garoppolo. Jacoby Myers, by the way, salute to him, man. Just an all-time Pat. Not all-time Pat, but all-time like good guy. You feel what I'm saying? He really was the most the most reliable guy for the Patriots. Just Mac Jones's and Tom Brady's just absolute security blanket. You could trust this man with everything, and he went ahead and just went about his business. Obviously, he had that play last season against the Raiders, which all end up showing. But at the end of the day, did I see Jacoby Myers leaving the Patriots? I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm gonna say yes. You wanna know why? Our wide receivers right now are um, Tyquan Thornton, the rookie from last year, Devontae Parker, and also Kendrick Bourne as well. You know what that screams? Wide receiver one and how we have really a need and a necessity for wide receiver one. And Myers, I'm not going to lie, he's good, but he's not a wide receiver one. Shout out to the Raiders. Y'all will love him. Um, Y'all can maybe move, uh, what's his name, Hunter Renfrew back to the slot. And Jacoby Myers as your as as wide receiver number two, right behind Devontae Adams. I feel like that'll be pretty good in my opinion. And then you have obviously Darren Waller as well. Shout out to him. He's got married to Kelsey Plum, uh, Las Vegas Aces superstar guard right there. Shout out to my boy um, Darren Waller. But um, Myers, man, this play he had last year right here, yeah. Against the Raiders, I literally don't know how I ended up making a video after this game because my God. This is just a tough watch right here against the Raiders. Literally, uh, let me just click play. So, Ramondre obviously gets a big run. We all know this play. I don't know why I'm going to watch this again, but this is, not my, this is not my play anymore. So, I guess I can actually sit back and laugh about this, even though literally it cost us the playoffs. Flips it back. He throws a ladder to Mac Jones. The former Patriot, Taylor Jones, absolutely bitches, absolutely stiff on Mac Jones. Jones on Jones crime and touchdown Jim Raiders and ended up winning the game after coming back from down seven on a play where Keelan Cole was out of bounds, got in, got in and ended up losing that game. So, uh, yeah. Well, Jacoby Myers, man, absolutely tough to see him go, but I'm not going to lie. If you don't get DeAndre Hopkins, if you don't get JSN, if you don't get Jordan Addison, if you don't get uh, Zay Flowers, then there is something wrong with Bill Belichick because you don't let a guy like Jacoby Myers just walk in free agency and just not go ahead and get somebody uh, better to replace him. Like what I tell you, he is the security blanket of the New England Patriots. He is the security blanket of the Pets. The Dolphins just got Jalen Ramsey. The Jets are about to get, apparently, Aaron Rodgers, potentially Alan Lazard, potentially Randall Cobb as well, which means, obviously, Aaron Rodgers probably is on his way to New York. Not officially, but we, know it's, we all know it's going to happen at the end of the day. Jets fans all want him. I think it's a foreign god conclusion that Aaron Rodgers will be a New York Jet. So, at this point, man, like, we can't run it back with the same roster all we've done is just re-sign players Devin McCourty retired shout out to him he had a nice um ad in uh, New England absolutely beloved here in New England shout out to Devin McCourty ended up retiring with the number 14 overall pick I want to see what we do with that do we go safety do we go tackle do we go wide receiver if you don't get a guy like DeAndre Hopkins I feel like we have to go wide receiver we have to go for a guy like JSN a Zay Flowers a Jordan Addison my opinion, I think one is JSN, and other than that, I'm not really a big college football guy, but I do know JSN. I think he's the best wide receiver in this draft class from what I've heard and what I've seen in tapes in all of that. So if we don't go out and get him. I'm very concerned. This would be a massive L if you don't I'll go up and do that. But I don't think Bill would just let Jacoby go if he doesn't have a bigger plan of wide receiver one for the New England pitch. Because like I said, he's absolutely beloved here in New England. We absolutely love Jacoby Myers. Your Raiders fans will absolutely fall in love with him. He's just so consistent. He had a 
he had trouble early on in his career with getting in the end zone but last year obviously he had a really good season like Jacoby Myers is just so consistent absolutely beloved here I just didn't see him coming back man like I said Tyquan Thorin Devontae Park had a really under the radar a year last year and also we have Kendrick Bourne as well hopefully can bounce back uh yeah, Jacoby Myers in the last two years last year 804 uh, yards six touchdowns and the year before that 866 yards and um two touchdowns so a miss out to him man 804 and six last year and 866 and two this year um i mean 844 and six 844 and two uh last year so shout out to Kobe uh, myers man absolutely love him tough to see him go like i said but a really, really reliable guy last year at 83 catches this year at 67 the year before uh 2021 he had 59 as well so shout out to him man shout out to Kobe myers man tough to see him go but we know it's for the better, man. We, uh, It's tough, Jacoby. We'll, we'll always love you out here in New England. But we needed a wide receiver one. And if Bill Belichick does not get us wide receiver one, and we let Jacoby Myers go for $11 million AAV in a very weak wide receiver free agency class where Jacoby Myers is the best wide receiver making $11 million a year. I would think he would get I mean, I think it's personally worth like 10 or 12 million dollars AAV. I was thinking he might have gotten somewhere between 12, 15, 16 because he's the best wide receiver in his draft class, but he only got 11. And he's back with Jimmy Garoppolo. I don't know if he played with Jimmy Garoppolo. I don't think so, if I'm being honest with you. I don't know, though. I honestly forgot. I honestly forgot. But, um, and he's back with Josh McDaniels as well. The, the vision is getting so much better. If we don't go out and make a splash, Bill Belichick, respectfully, buddy, your legacy will be on the line. Last couple of years, we've been trolling, you've been trolling as well. You literally got Matt Patricia to be our offensive coordinator, just ruined a year of Mac Jones' NFL career. And you have Joe Judge as well, who was just awful with the Giants. You got him off of the staff as well. And you wonder why we had the worst offensive football. You absolutely ruined Mac Jones' sophomore season. Yeah, he didn't play his best, but you definitely ruined it from his rookie season as well. I don't think he dropped off that bad from rookie year to sophomore year as well. So Myers is gone. Please, for the love of God, if DeAndre Hopkins isn't a New England Patriot, if JSN isn't a Patriot, if Zay Flowers isn't a Patriot, if Jordan Addison isn't a Patriot, this is a fail for Bill Belichick, and I will have some concerns about not only him, the whole team and the whole franchise as well. For a young quarterback in Mac Jones, you have to at least give him, this is Mac Jones's make it or break it year. This is the year to find out if he's that guy. If he's not that guy, okay. But I want him to go out soon again. I want him to go out with at least knowing that we gave him a true wide receiver one and so far we have not myers is good myers is really good actually as wide receiver two in this league as wide receiver one not so much could he have bust him to a, to a wide receiver one in our offense possibly potentially but i want to go out and get a defined wide receiver one a guy with crazy potential okay but hey if that doesn't happen like I said, uh, concerns, but the division is getting so much better around us. Yeah, we have all these rings, but at the end of the day, I want to be good now. Like, maybe that's asking too much, but I want to be good now as well, okay? But when I draft a free agent in 2019, Jacoby Myers is now making life-changing money. $33 million across three years for the LB Raiders. <sighs> Tough to see him go, but it had to be done. Just go out and get me a wide receiver one or a Belichick. We will have to have a major discussion about you and the whole Pats branches, okay? But other than that, yo, that is the video. Make sure to go down below, drop a like, comment down below, sub up. Make sure to follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and TikTok. It's your boy, John. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video, and I'm out, man. Peace.